Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, welcome to my YouTube channel, and today I'll be showing you guys how the tutorial of how to improve um, Mafia 3 graphics or, well, make a little modification. But basically, what you want to do is uh, go to this link. I'll be providing this in the um, description, and I will be also providing this one, which is the download one. This one, it, like, basically, you just, it just shows you. Uh, what you need and how to install it and stuff like that and it gives you a link by downloading uh, the thing over there which will eventually go to a text document you have to eventually go to this website so I'm gonna give you that in the description so what you want to do is download just download and then uh, save it into a file any file you want uh, I'm just gonna put it here just my own file and then you want to put show in folder and then you want to unzip. So make sure to put, uh, download um, WinRAR or 7-Zip. I'll be also putting uh, uh, um, a link to the description for that also. And so you want to put extract here. And what you want to do is uh, just copy these three things. So you want to select these three things. Wait, before you do that. Uh, go to your Mafia 3 folder. So the easiest way to do this is go to uh, go to your Steam, go to Mafia 3, press Properties, and then go to Local Files. And then what you want to do is browse Local Files, and voila, this is your Mafia 3 folder. And what you want to do is uh, go to the Sweet Effects folder, back to it again, and then copy only these three files. Uh, the reshade d2d11dll and reshade.fx and press copy and then what you want to do is go to copy uh, I mean go to right click and then put paste uh, for me it's showing this replace the file destination is because I already put those things onto the file I already modified it already but this for most of the people that's watching it is not going to show up for you of course because you never uh, installed um, a sweet effect reshade and stuff like that. So yeah, this is how you install. Uh, this set it's a pretty easy process. This is how you install it, and what this will be doing is it makes the coloration like you know how it gives that little green tint um, in the game. I mean not green, I'm a uh, yellow tint type thing, like a yellow coloration, and it looks so weird and it makes the graphic looks pretty bad. So what I did was basically. Um, just use this uh, sweet effects and then just uh, made a coloration better or something and and you also are recommended by the author of the um, of the sweet effect whoever made that uh, you want to go to my option and then uh, print everything the way he did it that's recommended you don't have to of course but that's how I did it and it matches with the way I do it I have a GTA 970 by the way, so I'm not going to be really uh, running in a full 60 FPS, but I'll be running in like in a pretty good setting. So yeah, let's just find out. Oh yeah, and this is after the new update that happened, which is the, uh, which uncapped the six, uh, the F, uh, the minimum FPS. So now I could do 60 and above and stuff like that. And even though I don't even approach 60, I get around 40 FPS, so. Sorry for the loading time, because it's going to be loading for a while. So while it loads, I'm going to say this. This is a great modification using Sweet Effects. It makes the game look way more better, like you won't even imagine. Like, I, I really love the game, and it's so awesome. See? You wasn't expecting this, was you? Look at how better it looks. I mean, the game, the creators could have made it more better looking. Either compared to GTA 5, they could have made it better or even more better than GTA 5. But, well, I guess they didn't. So, I could show you the difference. So, if you press uh, scroll log, you get the difference of how it looks in game. So, this is the game how it looked originally. Look how black, uh, look how darkish or like grayish it looks. It looks so yellowish. Come on, like, this is, like, 2016 game, like, you won't, uh, come on, the devs, like, really? And, well, 
the good things about PC, I love it, is you can modify. So yeah. And if I press uh, scroll lock again, this is where the modification comes in. This is what you do. Uh, this is what happens when you use the sweet effects. See? How beautiful it looks. Uh, I'll be... Alright. As you can see. And see how bland it looks? Like it looks so weird. It doesn't even look like a 2016 game like that. The graphics kinda look shitty though know, with that. But once you enable sweet effects, it looks hella more better. It looks like more of a 2016 game than before, like come on. See? Well yeah, so that was pretty much the tutorial, like if you guys uh really like and subscribe and support me. And I'm new to this, uh Look out. Oh, that's much this lady. Yep. Bro, was she just wow. Yep, she was, wasn't she? A sandwich, really. But yeah, like and subscribe, please. Um, and there will be more tutorial on maybe Skyrim, modding, and all this stuff also. But this is a short one, and it's an easy one, so I just might as well do it in a couple of minutes. So yeah. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and I hope you like and subscribe. And peace out, guys. Ooh, ooh, ooh.